Uh, practice run. So Greetings so all. So uh, it's been quite a while, hasn't it? Um, last time I think I copied and pasted and recorded some videos. It was probably around 15, 16, 2015, 2016. Um, so yeah, getting on seven, seven or eight years. So um, yeah, it's been a while. Um, the reason why that I'm creating these sort of copy and paste in all these videos now is um, is a, another strategy that I'm trying. I'm 46 years of age now. Uh, this is me and my wife and my two kids in, in our kitchen just uh, conjuring up some dinner just before just before Christmas this was. And um, I've just tried every single alternative angle of beating MS um, that you couldn't believe. I can, um, I'll probably make a video just to explain everything I've done. Obviously, there is no cure for multiple sclerosis using the, um, the pharmaceutical, pharmaceutical angle. So um, um, me just being a stubborn fucking shit, I've just tried as hard as I can um, other different angles. Um, this one is it's like one of it's one of the last throws of the dice. Um, I'm running out of ideas. Seriously, um, I've um, I've read a few books about diet, and um, obviously I've been trying before diet. I've actually just tried to do physical exercises, um, just every aspect that I can possibly do, um, which. It's, it helps. It definitely helps. Um, as you can see now, I've had primary progressive for 17 years, and I can still, in the proximity of my own home, obviously with a nice flat service surface, knowing exactly where everything is, what's going on. I can still stagger about, but um, yeah, you get this fucking bad boy out and about on the road. Um, gravel under his feet, rainy day. Wind, even wind has knocked me over, and um, yeah, but I can, I can, I can do it for a little while, and then um, my bladder kicks in, which affects my mobi mobility. And, um, heat is a one hell of a an aspect to it all, and that's the one thing that I've noticed is probably taking most most grip. Of, of it as it were um, with the heat um, I used to be able to believe it or not 10 years ago I went to a mate's wedding and I did manage to walk up and down the Las Vegas strip um, I don't know how long that is but I guess it's, it's a good 3 miles I would guess just off the top of my head without measuring it and um yeah, it was a struggle at the end, but I did manage to do it. Where now, um, just getting over the other side of the road, a, a mission, it really is. I still do manage to work, but it's such a selective few jobs that I use to um, to get my, to get the wage in. Okay, butting in and stopping myself waffling on. This is a little bit nearer the time. Today is the 28th of January it's the last Friday of the month and um, yeah just stopping myself I want to talk more about the diet more time um, about the what I'm actually doing at the moment um, I'm taking three big bowls of, um, sort of green leafy vegetables along with my protein and things like this um, there's no dairy involved but I can have two eggs so I'm taking two eggs every morning and then um, just sort of like meats and veggie, fish and things like this. These are the two books that I've read. Um, this is my current weight at the moment. Um, that's a previous um, picture of me whittled down. Um, I'm, I'm normally having to pull the plug um, on these darts just purely because of weight. This one, I can actually um, keep my weight maintained with um, extra virgin olive oil, um, which is working. Uh, I had about half a stone to lose, so I had a little bit of weight to play with, but um, I've sort of worked out 
how much uh, extra virgin olive oil I need. Probably about 10 tablespoons a day to maintain. These are all the foods that I've been eating, just been taking pictures. Um, haven't assembled them in any way, shape or form. I've just literally taken a picture of what I'm eating just to show you what it actually consists of. Like I said, three times a day, this must have been a breakfast with the boiled eggs. Um, that was scallops, I think, um, last weekend. And uh, yeah, that was gammon and eggs. So I think that must have been a breakfast as well. Um, nothing to report apart from this. Um, just under a week into it, my feet blew up and they were burning really, really heavily, as you can see. Um, go white to the touch. Um, touch base with her. And um, she said not to worry anything about it. This was like two or three days later. It's just a way of my body detoxifying itself, um, which sounded good. Do you know what I mean? Which built a lot of um, energy to me. So, um, yeah, front doors going. And um, I'll leave you with my little gang. See you soon. Put you down if you touch it again. Leave it alone. Don't touch it again, or you'll be down. Do I draw on the paper?
Let me have a look at these last night. Let me have a look at Auntie Joe, see? Let me have mine. What have you got on your lips? Green crayon. There it is, look. Green crayon. 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 Green crayon.
Big high thing now, do you? Yeah, because I'm getting big. No, you're yeah. a bigger boy, but you got it now. Because, because. Did you win on the rocket? Yeah, I mean, you went on the rocket, do you remember? Wow. At the fair? Yeah. Did you go on the biggest ride?
that's the lady name. I'm only going to stay for a week, that name says. Oh, no, I'm you want to try my glasses? Yes, I do. <laughs> what was that, Amazon, was that? Yeah. When you all that? Come and see Daddy, or if not, we'll go and watch the telly.
open open things. Okay? Open. Adiós.